Once upon a time, in a magical forest filled with tall trees and colourful flowers, there lived a little girl named Lila and her furry friend, Fluffly. One sunny day, as they were playing near a bubbling brook, they stumbled upon an old, dusty book hidden beneath a pile of fallen leaves. Excitedly, Lila opened the book and discovered that it was filled with stories of brave knights, beautiful princesses, and wicked witches. Fluffly's tail wagged with excitement as he sniffed at the pages, his ears perked up in curiosity. Lila, what if we go on a quest to find more pages like these? Fluffly barked eagerly, his eyes shining with excitement. Lila's eyes widened with excitement. That's a great idea, Fluffly. We could collect all the pages and make our own magical storybook. And so their adventure began. Armed with nothing but their imagination and determination, Lila and Fluffly set out to explore the forest in search of the magical storybook pages. Their first challenge came when they encountered a tricky puzzle hidden behind a grove of towering trees. Lila scratched her head, trying to figure out the riddle inscribed on a wooden plaque nearby. Fluffly, look, the riddle says, I am tall when I'm young and short when I'm old. What am I? Lila exclaimed, furrowing her brow in concentration. Fluffly tilted his head to one side, pondering the riddle for a moment before his eyes lit up with realisation. A candle, he barked excitedly, his tail wagging furiously. Lila clapped her hands in delight. You're right, Fluffly. Let's find a candle and see if it leads us to the next page. With Fluffly's keen sense of smell and Lila's quick thinking, they soon found a candle hidden beneath a bushel of wildflowers. As they lit the candle, a hidden passage appeared behind the trees, leading them deeper into the forest. As they ventured further into the forest, they encountered more challenges and puzzles, each one more difficult than the last. They solved riddles, decoded secret messages, and even outsmarted a mischievous band of squirrels who tried to lead them astray. But through it all, Lila and Fluffly remained determined, using their wits and teamwork to overcome every obstacle in their path. And with each page they collected, their excitement grew, knowing that they were one step closer to creating their own magical storybook. Finally, after many thrilling adventures and heart-pounding challenges, Lila and Fluffly reached the end of their quest. With a triumphant cheer, they placed the final page into their storybook, watching in awe as the forest around them shimmered with magic. As they flipped through the pages of their newly completed storybook, Lila and Fluffly felt a sense of pride and accomplishment wash over them. They had journeyed through the enchanted forest together, using their imagination and problem-solving skills to bring their own fairy tale to life. And as they closed the book and headed home, hand in paw, they knew that no matter what adventures awaited them in the future, they would always have each other and the memories of their great fairy tale quest to treasure forever.